Hey folks, it's Jim from Colton RV again. What we're looking at today is a 2020 Allegro bus with the new digital dash. On the driver's side console, there's a joystick control that controls the speedometer and the uh, settings on the dash. You can go through, if you look at, there's a highlight on the speedometer. When you turn the knob, it'll change it so you get your trip settings, the trip odometer, your gallons used, and your average speeds. And when you press and hold the joystick, it'll reset everything. Okay, now you can start your new trip with all new information. When you, you toggle over to the tachometer screen, it's going to show you gauges. And you can turn the selector and you can pull different data and different gauges and then there's a scan feature where you can select the scan feature and it's just going to keep scanning through all your gauges so while you're driving you can watch your different gauges to see what's going on with your engine and what's going on with your coach also in here is a brightness and you can adjust the knob to brighten it or dim it depending on what your preference is. Once you get to where you want, you press the knob to save it. You can go on to settings. You can move the screen setting up and down. You can change your needle colors. If you want white ones, red ones. Graphic scheme. You can change the different you can change the background. You can change the units. The sounds. You turn the tickers up, turn them down. And set up your compass. You can set and calibrate your compass from there as well. There's diagnostics that you'll be able to read to see if there's any um, trouble codes. You'll be able to see what your system information is. Your inputs and your outputs, which are going to give the technician a lot of information. The configuration feature is password locked so that's something that only a Tiffin tech can access and get a hold of and change so in summary that's about the the extent of what's going on here on the new dash and what you can do and I tell a lot of my customers this there's no self eject button there's no self destruct button so just play with the buttons make things work and see what they do because I don't know about everybody else, but that's the easiest way for me to learn. So just play with the buttons. There's nothing you can do to this coach that we can't undo. And thanks for watching.